Hello guys and welcome. I hope that you're having a good day or good morning or good evening. My name is I play 4K, AK, I play 8K, AK, I play 16K or UHD King. During this video, I'm going to show you how to fix MS Afterburner server information display information problem. River tuner server information problem so not showing the FPS temperatures frequencies uh, and um, how to fix it so um, I installed the uh, Counter-Strike Global Offensive or CSGO and I tried to play it in 16k resolution and my desktop right now is set to 16k resolution by the way let me show it to you I already recorded this video but uh, there is a problem and I learned how to fix it. So 15,360 pixels by 8,640 pixels, 100% scale. But this video is not about the 16K resolution. But if you're looking to see some 16K resolution, go ahead and visit the uhdking.com website or iplay16k.com. But anyways, and um, you install the MS Afterburner and uh, you want to play it. Or let's say you just took a pause like six months of pass, you didn't play CSGO or Construct Global Offensive and now you just loaded up the game on Steam, it's updated and it doesn't show the MS Afterburner statistics at all. No temperature, no FPS, nothing. Uh, first of all, you want to make sure that it, it is enabled. So you install the MS Afterburner uh, and you're going to go to on-screen display and over here there is a more button click on more button and it's going to bring you the MSI after burner somewhere on your desktop okay make sure that show on screen display is on and zoom kind of in the middle and uh, at the left top corner but it still doesn't show and you uninstall the MSI after burner you uh, reinstall it install the older version still doesn't work but it did work before you uninstall your drivers or let's say you just replace the video card and this issue appears okay it's all kind of different scenarios but I'm going to give you one fix that's going to fix it that's going to provide you a solution during this video so um, okay let me demonstrate to you so as you can see it's on it's supposed to show like in the different games but it doesn't show in the Constrike Global Offensive or CSGO and uh, so pretty much I'm going to go ahead and uh, open up the Constrike Go so this is the Constrike Go with a 400% zoom on 16K resolution. I just wanna, I'm gonna click play. And it's going to load it up. I'm going to load up the game. Let me zoom out. And it's supposed to be at the left top corner. But however, you're not going to see anything. And this is upsetting factor if you, let's say, want to demonstrate your new video card potentials and performance in terms of the FPS, temperature to your friends. Well, there is a solution. You got to go ahead and quit it. As again, it's not your video card, it's not the Windows operating system, it's not the NVIDIA drivers, and uh, it's not the MS Afterburner. It's just a Counter-Strike Global Offensive or CSGO developers implemented or integrated the filter that pretty much do not allow any third party application access to the DirectX API of the CSGO PC game or Counter-Strike Global Offensive P PC game just to make sure that there is no cheating because they fighting against the cheating and this is what they implemented. So they're not going to study. Uh, you will tell me, well, MS Afterburner is not cheating. Yes, I agree with you, but they're not going to study which application are cheating or which one is not. So there is a single fix. It took me like three hours of study to find out. So click, right click on Counter-Strike Go under uh, Global Offensive, under your library in the game Steam, go to Properties. So you click left, right mouse button, you click right mouse button, and Properties, click on Properties. It's going to open up the window. 
right here, somewhere in the center of your Steam game client, you, you need to go to general. Keep in mind that user interface can change, but it's going to be just the same. Under the general, it's going to say launch options, advanced users may choose, let me zoom in for you, may choose the modification to their launch applications. And here's what you gotta type. You gotta type like this, exact like this, guys. Okay, type this command. So dash allow underscore tort underscore party underscore software. Okay, you gotta close this window and launch the Counter-Strike Global Offensive again. Or CSGO. So what this command does, it's pretty much going to disable this filter. So this filter uh, uh, by default is enabled, is on, but you just disable it and uh, it's not going to ruin your gameplay or something like that it's just going to disable it so you will have ability let me show it to you I just sorry okay it's running so in a second it's going to boot it up so you will have ability guys to load it up here we go and it's going to show up and then you can change the position as you can see I'm using the very advanced MSI afterburner display information system that I programmed but anyways it's going to show you the FPS temperature in the basic of values for you not like advanced like mine but it's it's going to show so now you can go ahead and operate and display it to your friends on the videos etc 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 all right that that's it guys that's pretty much it and thank you so much for watching don't forget to smash that like button subscribe i just save tons of hours of your time because you got to do a lot of researches and a lot of fakes uh or misinformation that was provided to you over the steam how to fix it none of those um you know forms worked out for me and uh, this is the only solution and it's going to work out it's going to pretty much uh for any kind of uh, scenarios new video card updated MS after burner updated seam updated CSGO PC game or do whatever you want to do but it's going to show up pretty much you just disabled the third party um, software filter and it's not showing any longer okay for Counter-Strike Global Offensive in 16k resolution or CSGO in 16k resolution go ahead as again visit the hdking.com website or I play 16k.com website is going to be a great video. Go ahead and check it out. Go through that playlist and check out the CSGO 16k running on RTX 2080 Ti and the Titan RTX. Both of them in SLI, then RTX 3080, RTX 3090. It's going to be a great video. Hopefully, guys, it was pretty valuable information for you. As again, subscribe, smash that like button, share it with your friends, and I will see you guys. Till the next time, have a great day, stay safe, play well.